What's happening guys? We're back and we're gonna be building that firewall pedal cover today. All right, so a quick detour before we get rolling on that uh, that firewall pedal enclosure thing. Um, I was looking at my intake tubes last night and I realized that last time we went and bought the uh, the aluminum bends to build all of our intake charge pipes, uh, they gave me one that was the wrong size. So we need to go pick up some more two and a half inch tubing. So I got a little guy with me in the back seat there. We're gonna run into Calgary and pick up some tubes. tubes we also managed to to find a master cylinder for our clutch and uh the little guy got to watch the cars go by so uh successful trip had by all we'll see you guys back at the shop and we're back out in the shop um that was a very successful little trip into mopac this morning uh got my my master cylinder for the clutch which we've been waiting to get for a while and then uh the proper sized elbows to finish up the intake track um, but that's not what we're doing today so we're just going to put those off to the side we are working on the firewall so if you remember there was this kind of box area right here that we had to cut out for the pedals because um, the pedals are going to live on the inside of the firewall i guess so we have to build an enclosure around this to seal them up so I took the panel that we cut out and mounted it up here with just two rib nuts on the front there. And then I've got started building this kind of side panel here. Um, so it'll screw onto the firewall here and we'll weld it onto this guy here. And then it sits on the chassis at the bottom. So uh, by the end of this episode, I wanna have this entire box enclosure at least tacked up and ready to weld. So we need to trim this guy up a little bit more, trim this guy up a little bit, and then cut a top plate and another side plate. And then basically we're just gonna get some cardboard, template out the holes, cut those, tack them in. Bob's your uncle. So let's get after it.
right, that turned out awesome. Uh, we got all the panels tacked up. Some of the panels we had to put a little extra bend in in order to get them to kind of follow the contours correctly because there is this weird kind of bent section over here. But uh, the other ones were all just flat panels, trace them out and away we went. So that worked great. Um, this is as far as I was intending on going today was just getting them tacked together. There's a whole bunch more work in the finish welding and also in getting the flange kind of figured out, drilling some holes, tapping them, making that all work. But uh, I didn't want to do that today. I'll probably do that tomorrow off camera. Uh, you guys have seen me weld enough that uh, it's just, I don't need to film it. So I'll do that tomorrow, get that finished, weld it up. And then next week we will move on to something else. Um, we might move on to wiring. That's been kind of looming in the background for a while. Or I also have everything, I believe everything I need to start running fuel lines. So maybe we can do that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens next week. So in the meantime, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, hit the like and subscribe button. Go check us out on Instagram, Left Foot First Media. And we'll see you next week. I'm out of here.